Now at 530, the battle over abortion rights is back in the spotlight as the Supreme Court takes up its first major case of the Trump era. CBS 4's Skylar Henry is there. As protesters from both sides of the abortion debate rallied outside the Supreme Court, justices heard arguments on a Louisiana law that tightened regulations on abortion clinics. Kathleen Pittman is with the Shreveport Clinic at the center of the case. Women in Louisiana deserve abortion care. They should be able to determine if and when they expand their families. It's the first abortion case to reach the high court since conservative Justice Brett Kavanaugh was appointed by President Trump. The law in question requires doctors to have admitting privileges at nearby hospitals, which abortion providers say is not always possible. Louisiana's attorneys argue it's a matter of safety. We know that there are serious complications from abortion. It is documented abundantly in our F in our record. The case doesn't directly challenge Roe versus Wade, but the stakes are high. If the court upholds Louisiana's law, it could leave the state with just one abortion provider. It is alarming and it is unacceptable that in the year of 2020, there are still states that are hell bent on preventing women from getting access to reproductive health care. Those opposed to this case say it's identical to a Texas law the court struck down in 2016. Everything about our case is different, and we should be able to protect the health and safety of women. The court's decision is expected by the end of June. Skylar Henry, CBS News, the Supreme Court. Pro-choice advocates say if the court upholds the Louisiana law, it could open the door for similar restrictions in other states.